as auto set also, so. Uh, mine does also. Yeah, so we're all saving. Okay, so turn. And then I'm also doing hard saves. You don't have to do a hard save every time, but do it periodically. Yeah. Hard ones we're actually doing. Ooh, yeah, some happened. ambassador came to me. Ooh. Administrator lied on the Nova wants to work for me. What are his? ADBC a turn now zero per turn. He's plus ten diplomat, minus sixty BC. I'm famous and mega wealth plus ten BC. He's the same Ooh, guy nice. I have. So hire him. Get him he's gonna, yeah, hire him because he's gonna make you money, and then deploy him to your planet. Okay, so where do I deploy him from? Uh, click leaders, and then click on your home world, and then click on him. If you're in your galaxy, click on him. You'll deploy there. It's not gonna take any time whatsoever to deploy to your home world because he's already there. Okay, there he's deployed. If you don't deploy him, you don't get his benefits. That's pretty self-explanatory. Yeah. That was my turn. Is it master or it's master, not masters, right? No, it's master, like bell master of Iran. Not yeah. of Iran. Oh, there's a. There's a what? Oh, a drop down. Thank you. When I started typing it, it was a drop down. Yeah, when you do it there in, in the thing, it does that. Do the same thing for my channel while I'm waiting for you. Nice, thank you. Nice. Nice. Build is required. What build is required? Oh, English. To pray game move? Yes. Pray game move. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to have to save it. Just Here we go. Tablet, make sure that this is giving us all the audio and everything that we need. I, I can check that for you. Oh, okay. As soon as Mozilla cooperates, I seriously don't know what they've done to it. Dad. I'd go check for you, but then I'd have to hear my own voice on stream, and I think I sound like a weasel when I have to hear myself, and I don't like that. <laughs> so what you're saying is you only sound like a weasel when you're listening to yourself? Yes, it's unfortunate. Alright, we are live. That's also unfortunate. <laughs> well, we were live on my channel for, for like the past five minutes. Yeah, but you don't have viewers, so it doesn't matter. Well, the point is to send the video to the YouTube channel. <laughs> So I always try to use official um, information whenever I can, as far as like tags or titles of the game. You know, rather than doing a, a manual type in, I always use the drop-down box, so that triggers copyright protection. Um, like content oh, cool. copyright protection. I, I so really, I think I'm it's going to go Tiny Wisp. Winter Wyvern we don't hurts that combo so badly. You're, you're not going to get sued over Master Right, that's yes. a big question. Unfortunately, the internet is out on this laptop. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they use it against Secret and Best of Three and Dirt Pit. No, it, yes, they did. They did. They did. They ran a winner. I promise not to exploit the fact that Brian probably won't have any defense by the time I build a battle cruiser. Thanks. Okay, I have to add a Skype monitor. Why is this not coming through? Hey Brian, do you know how to add Skype? Oh yeah, it's uh, go to, it's right there, add Skype video. Click in the bottom left hand corner, you see add to your, uh -huh. to your presentation stage. Click add, drop down arrow, and then Skype video is like the sixth one down. Okay. What if I just want the audio? It's the same thing. Okay. It, it's it, Skype is, is is being sent through your uh, through your system sounds. Hmm. So you don't have to worry yeah, about and that. How do I make this the full screen? 
you kind of have to grab it and slide it around a little bit. If you click on the presentation stage, it'll slide it around a little bit. Okay. There's always something, there's always some kind of technical difficulty. Oh, I can drag and make it bigger. So there's some kind of technical difficulty. I don't want to hide the Skype logo. Okay, so that channel is coming. See, I don't even have Skype added to the thing, and it, and it's brought, it broadcasts my sound. Gotcha. So I, I just heard myself say that just some kind of technical difficulty. I'm checking your channel now. How do I get rid of this stupid Skype logo? Turn it off. Well, I thought I needed the Skype thing up to get the sound. No. It's, it, Skype is being sent through your s system sounds. How do I get rid of this stupid Skype logo? Yeah, you just said, how, <laughs> I just listened to you say that. How do you get rid of that well, Skype Well, I thought logo? I needed the Skype thing up to get the sound. Yeah, but on the stream, it's only my voice coming in. That's what I mean. Like my no, it's because it's up. because we're quiet. You have to adjust your sound settings. I could change that and set my mic. I set my mic half. No, 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 no. It's not that. No, it's his system. Like it's it, it's taking in his mic at a different at a different level. I'm not sure what what the difference is, but it's it's in your volume mixer thing. Alright, I've just jacked the volume up there. Let me see. Somebody's got some something whistling. I hear it through someone else's headset. It must be coming from me because I don't hear it on my own headset. I only hear it through like Brian's headset. Him listening to you makes me hear it. It's coming through on, on Skype, so somebody's got something go running in the background. That's what it is. All right, well, I just tested by muting my microphone for 15 seconds, so it's not me. I don't think it's a microphone. Uh, no, if I mute my microphone, which I hit the Skype mute button, that means I'm not transmitting sound to you. Oh, gosh, I'll do it again. Let me uh, mute mine. Let's see what happens. Yeah, there it went. There's yeah, some was... There's some sound coming through on your system. Do you have do you have a channel open in the background or something like a video playing? I have the the Twitch thing because I'm trying to test the close the that audio. close that. No, not on the computer on my tablet. Mute that. Yeah, it sounds. Yeah, there it went. There it went. I think I think what's going on is that we're picking up the sounds from this game on there. Well, that's the problem because we're still only getting my voice on the Twitch channel. No, when I I could when I go back to your channel, give me a second. Alright, this broadcast. <clears throat> oh hey. Hello. I get to click the turn. <laughs> Sorry about that. Commander Valar will wait a while to see if you can raise the money. I don't have the cash. Dang it. Hello. Oh, oh he's a traitor. I was a navigator with me. I will. Commander Valar. Get an lot of officers, one of the joined my illustrious empire. <laughs> hey, cold fusion. Hey, I'm doing physics finally. Yay. Hey, cold fusion. It might be in like general 
settings or something. Audio. System sound. Oh, Jesus. Playback devices. Hey, Mike. Okay. Mike, can you stop for a second? Stop what? Talking. <laughs> yeah, I can hear the two of you in the background. You're there. You're not as loud as me, but you're there. I take it I come in fine. Talking. Yeah, I can hear the two. All right, what about now? now? Yeah, let's hold on. Let's see what he's in there. Well, all right, I'm talking for the sake of talking then, I guess. I take it I come in fine. Yeah, I can hear you fine. Okay, right. I just changed my default speakers to make sure that it is. It's probably, probably good that I cut my volume in half when I normally have it, because apparently when I have it set, what I normally do. No, 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 I was, I, it was what I did to change it. Yeah, I can hear you fine. Alright. Okay, uh, I had two different, um, speaker outputs going. Uh, broadcast was only Okay. Fair enough. Alright, let's go. Uh, is fusion or should I go to something else? I went to physics, because I like having, like, the default stuff right away. Because my OCD is going to go insane if I can't. Yep. Like, Things like scan or move. Well, like have shifts. I guess I'm still <laughs> waiting to do not to do something. Yeah, that what what he did was added 40 turns to the game. But so I'm not yeah, actually upset. Just... I just I'm being snarky about it. It's not. I'm not actually upset. <laughs> you just being snarky. This thing keeps saying I'm like 44 turns away from building this thing. It's because we started with like absolutely nothing, so it takes forever. Alright. We have no production, we suck. Like we have like the lamest empires in history right now. Yeah. Well, oh, hopefully got, hopefully everybody's that way. I've got someone who's giving me like... Yeah, somebody's giving you... Yeah, someone's giving me like 10 research a turn right now, so... I just, I'm getting out of this crap, like, really quick. <laughs> yeah, I could build a freighter fleet, but I don't want to. Make sure you don't click too rapidly, because if, uh, if your mouse is anywhere near the uh, end turn button, there's no going back after you hit end turn. Well, at this point in the game, I don't think that matters. Well, no, I'm just saying for later. I need to turn this speaking game down. This DOS music. Yeah. yeah, I had to turn the music down too. Hey, it's good okay. for what it was. Well, I mean, for the stream, I definitely don't want it that loud. Alright. Yay, I get to click the turn button again. I'm done mm -hmm. in uh, eight turns with my colony base. What? Really? I'm unification. What do you want from me? And that's only with one guy building. Yeah. Like, I'm already creating pollution with one dude. Jeez. Let's see. I'm unification. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I did not. Oh, sorry, I did not. Yeah, I did not take tolerant this time though. So I'm actually affected by. I forgot I swapped it out with the telepathic crap. Yeah. Yeah, I get 50% bonus in production and 50% food production. So, yeah, it's actually massive bonuses to my ability to build crap. Okay. Sorry about the noise. We'll be gone right. right. Yeah, just as far as getting my volume closer to what you guys are pushing out, I needed to move my microphone. Pretty soon I'll be able to do something besides hit and turn repeatedly. <laughs> That's all I've been doing. That's probably why I'm getting through this so fast. I can just 
send a bunch of guys on research and have one guy produce. So in a really weird way, I'm, I've got a slight advantage here. Oh wow, 100% turn completion. Glad I had to spend double the research points on that tag. <laughs> that stinks. One thing you can do in this game, Brian, is you can stockpile uh, production by building something that takes forever and swapping it whatever you want. As long as you don't finish the production, you carry over to something new. And it works with research in this game, too. Oh, it's like when uh, you spent 20, 25 turns building a wonder. <laughs> yeah, and Civ 5, I think, was the first one to lose the stockpiled production. It was deliberately added to this game. So. Yeah, I want biospheres, because I don't need the plus two to my farming, because my farmer is already better than your farmers. Oh man, I'm tired. No yawning. <laughs> yeah, it's just a bunch of next turn, next turn, next turn. <laughs> this environmentalist reduces the pollution level of your planet by 15%. Uh, go away. I already have like a million off. I already have more ambassadors I could possibly use. Go away. Okay, let me see if I think I can afford to get my. My, uh. Oh, he's a ship officer anyway. Well, you can stockpile that. Like, they're giving you research. I think they'll give it to you anyways. I'm not. Yeah, gonna... plus he's got mega wealth, so I still want him. The only thing I suck, the only thing I really suck at is research. I'm not even that bad, I'm just not good at it. The, the part I'm good with with research and quotations is I can just throw extra people on research if I want to, because why not? My points are worth more anyway. It just takes me way longer to assimilate an enemy empire. If I weren't telepathic, which I am. Because <laughs> I just mind control the entire populace into being subservient to my empire. <laughs> That's probably a little bit more humane than nuking their planet to oblivion. Uh, yeah, I've gotten mad at people before and just use toxic spores. And if you use poison on an enemy planet and just use death spores on them, everyone in the game gets permanent negative relations with you. Yeah, like they, if you use any weapons of mass destruction. And yeah, they consider it inhumane when you gas entire planets, apparently. Or like, I don't remember what it's called, but it's like the... The star... Star in a gun thing, Inter sort of the, the interstellar, the interstellar converter, the one where you destroy planets. Yes. It's like if you annihilate a planet, if you play Death Star on a planet in this game, same thing. Yeah, they all hate you. Well, yeah, because you built the Death Star. <laughs> Which Brian, you can do. We can we can build the Death Star and annihilate planets. Well, what's funny is like my friend Chris rushes that with research. He attacked my battleship and he didn't even break through the shields. He went, huh? His new strategy was to fly past me and shoot my planet and fly away. Because he couldn't fight my capital ship, but I couldn't stop him from blowing up my planets. It was really mm. pissing me off. Because his attack was so high that he got to move first automatically in combat, and he got to take two actions for every turn. So he'd fly in, blow up my planet, and then retreat immediately. It was really annoying. So. What do we need? To be able to build scout ships, we need chemistry and physics still. So we need like the basic of everything, essentially. Yes, which I already have. So we're doing chemistry next. Um, you need a star we... base before you can build uh, anything, I think. No, that's well, the only thing. We start harder. off with the star base. You had to customize ships. You have to be able to build the ship. Oh, design. Here we go. Oh, yeah, you have to have the ship to begin with to be able to design one. Oh, well. The Darlock's over there, and like. Pretty much all I'm doing. I don't remember having this much wait time. I wonder if I usually don't do pre warp.
There's my colony base. I need to build a freighter fleet. Actually, why would I buy it? I'm gonna buy the fuck. I'm gonna buy the. Yeah, I'm still just focusing on population growth. And that's because I have a horrible other planet in my solar system. I just dropped 200 bucks and bought a freighter. <laughs> Not a colony ship? If you think I can afford a colony ship which costs 500 production, you're insane. <laughs> That's like 3,000 bucks. What's the freighter gonna give me? Uh, it's, it, have... it's, it lets you ship food and production and people. So it's like an If internal... I wanted to get one, where would I get it? You buy, you build it. Or? If you can buy production. So on my planet, I have to go look at my planet. It's like an internal trade caravan from Sue. You know, like rather than trading with somebody else, it's trading with. Except they're almost mandatory in this game, because yeah. not every planet can make. Should it. I click the buy button? No, don't buy it. Like, don't waste your yeah. money right now. Only do it yeah, like I am if you're cheesy. If I wanted to. Yes. So you that would buy. give me the choices of what to buy. I wouldn't buy what. No, currently it would being buy there. the production to finish off whatever you have in your production pool. Yeah. So where do so I you pick can it? Uh, once you've already selected it as something you are currently building, buy. It just finishes off whatever you're currently building. Hmm. Okay. And turn. Sorry, I'm, I'm like having to make an actual decision right now. What are you trying to decide? Oh, for like science or something? Yeah, it's, I'm doing science even stuff right now. I think I'm gonna give this one ten more minutes, then I'm done with this one for today. <laughs> you haven't even done anything with it. Yeah. That's yeah, like, just getting so... familiar with the interface is in and of itself something. You know, just something. You want to try that Path of Exile next? Sure. That one's on Steam. bought like a bunch of ships. So. Transports? No, scouts. How did you get scouts? What did you research to get scouts? Uh, I finished the uh, chemistry, I think it was. Uh -huh. I don't know. Or, or yeah, I finished all of the default ones. The only reason why I know which ones are the ones that are default is because it let me have all three at immediately. So if it's, uh -oh. if it's something for like freighters and colony ships and whatever, it gives you scouts also. Because I already got the freighters and colony ships, but I don't have access to scouts. You don't have them over there? No. Do you have everything in physics and do you have did you get everything in the physics? Did you get everything in power and did you get everything in chemistry? I've got power, I've got chemistry, I need to do physics still, that's the problem. Actually. Yeah, I think you need to do physics first. Because oh you don't have any weaponry, so you can't have a scout. Yeah, you have to have armor, you have to have propulsion, you have to have weapons. Yeah, Target. you don't have anything that can build a military grade vessel. Oh, right, I should hit enter instead of just standing here looking at it. Yeah. That would be a good idea. Blue-white stars are, unli are, li are likely to have planets that are more rich than... Oh, right. The star colors actually mean something. Yellow planets are pretty balanced. White stars are. Yeah, except for Ooh, arms. 
there's a wormhole over there. Right there. Mm, I don't know if I want this guy or not. Ugh. A ship officer that oh, whose only skills are ship to ship combat. I have to pay one one gold a turn. But don't take him, we don't want him. No, no, I reject it. If I change my mind, I can get him. <clears throat> oh, what is this? Director Aurelia, the Siren. Pay her 180 up front and two a turn. Done. Spiritual leader, diplomat, and famous. Damn, this yeah, is amazing. Yeah. How many a turn? Two a turn? Yeah. Like it says, you pay two PC a turn, or she gives you two PC a turn? I think I pay her. Oh. Yeah, if she doesn't have Mega Wells, you're paying her. So now I've got her, what do I do with her? Can I can yeah, I deploy her somewhere? To kind of deploy to the same world? You Only can't. one. So, so she says she's gonna sit in your pool for now. Okay, so just leave her there for now. Yes, unless you want you her could. more than the guy you already have deployed. Well, the guy I have is that light on. The mega wealth guy. Yeah, leave mega wealth for now. He's gonna pay for her. <clears throat> okay. Each time Mega Wall is not going to mean anything later, but early game, it let me do stuff like buy a bunch of crap I don't need right now. I mean, I need it, but... God, I'm just surrounded by, like, really crappy planets. By the way, did you get that, um, that, that other game I was talking about? Like, the, the Endless Journey? Me? Mm-hmm. Uh, not yet, no. That was another one of those. It's like, it's a turn, another turn-based one, but it's got a, other elements to it. I was I've been looking at it. I was planning I on trying it today. Okay. Is it, if it's multiplayer, I can pick it up. I'm pretty sure it is. That's one of the reasons I got it. Ah, yes. Yeah, I think I should be able to do scout ships after I finish this research. I'm working on it now. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 I can do scout ships now. I just needed to finish chemistry. Yeah. Alright, so design a scout ship. Don't even bother designing scout ships right now. Like, you only have, because you only have yeah, the base. It's going to automatically put the base on there. Yeah. You want to design when you actually have crap that you want to change out on it. So, I, I run default until, like, mid-tech, and then I swap everything. Also, if Brian doesn't want to play, like, if you want to, like, make Brian not quit every 10 minutes, we want to keep the game slowing. At least, well, I can't I do this. Build a cruiser class ship if you want to one it takes a while yeah I'm using scouts right now because well a scout because I'm just sending a place to see where everything is and if he runs into a giant space monster I don't care yeah. I just know not to go there I'm not in a hurry because we didn't put it although if you would have kept Antares on and then made his pre-warp I would have punched you yeah, because that they're not. They're not pre-warp, and they won't wait. That'd have been funny, actually. So, do you know if you have gotten your next or your first? Do you know if you have studied chemistry yet? I'm just surrounded by empty I'm, galaxies. I, I think I'm getting it this next turn. Okay. I'm working on it right now. Okay. Okay. So two I'm turns. I'm surrounded by these solar systems that have absolutely nothing in them. They're just wastes of space. Mm -hmm. Although, if you get uh, at the end of the texture, if you get planetary construction, you can just build planets and empty solar systems. It's ridiculous. Mm -hmm. Turn, turn, turn. Uh, I've, I, I'm playing the Moroccans in my in my latest solo play, solo game. Oh, that's interesting. I wanted. I wanted anywhere near. What was that? Are they the ones that build the the desert fortresses? Yeah, the kibosh or something like that. Yeah. Yeah, I got them because they have a boost to trade thing. Problem is, the, like, the place where I got deposited it looked like it was in the middle of a desert, so with nothing around it. 
So I was on a river with another city to the to the to the east along another river. It turns out that was the edge of the map. So I was like, okay, well, I can't go for that direction. Well, I found the world wonder, a natural wonder, and I deposited a city there so I could get was the ten gold a turn one. Mm -hmm. So I've got that, and then later when I went to trying to find because I'm I'm in the game where I'm being marauded by barbarians. Yeah. So I went to get the uh, I went to find where they were so I could take them out. On the ocean to the south, so I went and popped just plopped a city down there. Oh, nice. Okay. I didn't. I didn't. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to get the great library. I was ticked at that. Yeah. I'm gonna rush automated factories so I can build this crap faster. Yeah, I, I need to do that. I did get chemistry, by the way. Large abundant swamp. Okay, if you've got chemistry now, then you would want to go to your home world. Okay. Go up to change. Away from colony base. Uh, well, how many turns left do you have on colony it's, base? It's 37. It's stuck at 37. Yeah. Go away from it. Do you have uh, scout? Do you have some military ships down there now? Too? Scout, scan, scanned boo, which looks like a... I'm not sure what it is. It's like the ships. Uh, they're different, yeah, they're, they're all different ships. Classes. They're different classes of ships. The scout should have extended fuel Back tanks. Uh, yes. So you'd want to pick a scout just so you can start exploring the the other solar system. So can you. can I move it to the top or do I? Yeah, there. It's moved to the top. Yep. And then just leave that. Um. Well, what I would do is build the scout, and then the next one in the queue be a colony ship. Um. But the colony base might not be a bad idea. What do you do? You still only have trade goods and housing on the left side. Um, I just tried to move the colony ship above the colony base, and it deleted the colony base. Oh, that's fine. Okay, so trade goods you is over on the left, it. yeah. And then, so it's just trade I mean, goods housing. and housing. Nothing else. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So scout then colony ship. Okay, I got it. Or... Yeah, I got to do something. Uh. Says one turn. We shall see. <laughs> okay. I just sent my my officers over to my scout. All right, uninhabitable, uninhabitable, arch baron. Rolling in cash, just about how fast I'm spending it. Okay, so now I have a ship. What do I do with it? Alright, so do you see the little dot, the little colored dot near your world? Yeah, I got it. Click on him, mm -hmm. just once, yeah. and put your cursor over a star system near your home planet. Okay, I clicked what on it. What you're looking for is a green dotted line. Yep, I got it. Alright. Two turns. If it's beyond his his reach, you know, the reach of his fuel and, and engines, then you would get a red dotted line. And if you run across, like, a space worm or something, just run. Don't stop and fight, not with a scout. Say that again, sorry. So you can run into things. So it's either going to be an empty area, or you'll like have a chance to run into something special. Mm -hmm. That something special could be something like artifacts or something nice, but it could also be like a flying space worm. Oh, joy. Yeah, so you would want to run away from that, because a scout would get his butt kicked. Okay. Uh, if you can run away, if your tech's too bad, you just get a Stable away. wormhole. Yeah, what? they let you... Nice. Oh, I've two already. Oh. Okay, so I have two a tiny baron, one max pop, abundant low G world, and a small baron, three max pop, abundant world. Those are just like for when you build a colony ship, yep. the place is believable. And I have a wormhole to that if blue star. Out, if you have an outpost ship, put them on the most useless hunks of whatever 
impossible because you can't output ships are just there to extend your range and refill your ships. Okay. Now, and that wormhole goes from. Okay, so you see those stars, the two red stars in the upper we upper left portion of the map. The, the second one down is called Virgo, and it has a wormhole connecting it to the uppermost blue star on the right. Nice. So, now what do I do with my scout ship? Um, send him somewhere else. Either either target the wormhole if you want to explore up there, or just go to another planet. I like to explore all the planets near me, just so I'm not surprised by anything. Yep. Or all the systems, yep. maybe I should say. That's what I'm doing. But Ryan, what do you think? Wait, what? I have Four molar anything. systems near you. What was that? Do you take wormholes first, or do you just explore the systems near you first? I'm exploring all of it, but uh, I, I, it's, I'm weighing my option at the moment because I don't have any, I don't have anything. I can't drop stuff anywhere. I've also can't explore anywhere anymore because I've hit the limit on how far I can go without building a post. Oh. Oh, never mind. I can go here. So I can go to from PX there. So. God, I can, I can. I just have one more spot I can jump. But I'm building a colony ship right now, and then I'll build some outposts to extend my range. Mm. Yeah. Not wasting time on it. Unfortunately, because we're on pre warp, it's taking a really long time. Oh, somebody wants a labor leader. Oh. Offering me nothing. Wants me wants to join me for nothing. He says offers to join you for zero BC now and one BC a turn. Labor leader plus ten percent. That's nice. It'll give you extra production if he's the active administrator on a colony. Yeah. Okay. So. Okay. So anybody... I have that other the the the, the uh, upper left red star, two planets, huge baron six max pop, abundant heavy G, and then small radiated three max pop, abundant. Man, you haven't come across any good planets yet. Save your colony ship till you find a Terran planet. That's my that would be my suggestion. Because then you get like sixteen population. Do I ever have to go back to my main place to refuel? Yes. For okay. now. Okay, so do a should, you get an outpost. should I head back to refuel before I go to another star? No. No, you won't get stranded. Okay. It won't let you go far enough to get stranded. If you do get stranded, I'll force you back to your nearest base. Like, you don't get your base, you guys don't just die. They'll just start uncontrollably flying back to the nearest area. You can okay. And if it's okay with you guys, I'd like to call this. Absolutely. Well, we've got a nice little... Um, chunk. Yeah, a nice chunk. Some, some introductory, you know, the interface starting on research, building things, how to interface with the queue, explore, things like that. We can come back to it later if we can ever get if we can ever get uh, Magnus to play. <laughs> we'll end the turn and I'll save the game. Mm -hmm. hey, we're, we're finishing already? We haven't even done anything. We've been, we've been at this for an hour and a half. There are other things I'd rather do. Well, that's because we started in, like, add time to the game mode. Yes, we did. Alright, somebody still needs to press next turn. It's me, it's there. Okay, here we go. Alright, we'll save it at the start of this turn. That's the end of next we, we could you could have set up the game. So you can set it the way you want to, and then we can just start from there. This could be our slow one, that one could be our this is the way you want to play a game. Well, this one's fine now that we've actually got going. It just we finally <laughs> got going. Like we got to the part where we should have been at the beginning of the game. Fine. The game also starts you with a colony ship. Huh. Don't have. You get a colony ship with two scouts like immediately. Damn. Is it saved? It is saved and we are done broadcasting. So, game. I'm gonna wait till you guys are out before I quit. I'm out. Uh...